How to Profit from Huge Inflation Ahead for Beginners For consumers, inflation means higher prices on goods and services, and the risk of a loss of purchasing power if their income fails to keep up. Conversely, a decline in prices is known as deflation. In economics, inflation is a quantitative measure one of quantity over quality tracking the rate of change in prices of a standardized basket of goods. Inflation is defined as an increase in prices over time, and the rate of that increase is expressed as a percentage. Inflation has been a big concern for a lot of investors, particularly recently. You know it's been something that we haven't had to worry about for the past 40 or so years. We've managed to maintain it around that 2% mark, and that is perfect. But there is a range of investors like Ray Dalio, Charlie Munger and Michael Burry, who are warning that inflation may be on the horizon. So let's take a look at some of these warning signals that we're seeing. First this is something that not enough people are talking about is the consequences of all this printing of money. So we had the pandemic, and we had a lot of people who needed money. The government did what they pretty much had to do, and they backed in the trucks and shipped off a bunch of free money to the people. They gave trillions of dollars to businesses that were struggling with their loans, struggling with emergencies, and had the general need for cash. They spent hundreds of billions with tax relief given to individuals who weren't working. Hundreds of billions into medicine, and the same again for government needs. But anyone who understands sound economic principles will know that this isn't the case. One of the major problems that come with printing trillions of dollars is inflation. Because if you start handing out free money to people, demand for goods increases. They have more money to spend. And when demand increases, what happens to prices, they rise. An overview of the best stocks for profit from huge inflation can be found below. Hey everyone! How are you doing today? Before proceeding with the video please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel Trade VSA for exciting content. 1. Cryptocurrency Bitcoin is fundamentally a deflationary asset, which is why citizens of countries with unstable fiat currencies are increasingly using it as a store of value to protect against hyperinflation and rising costs of everyday goods and services. Bitcoin is often described as digital gold and theoretically should protect against inflation because of limited supply. But the jury is still out on whether it will be a good inflation hedge over the long term, Arnett says. And as a warning to investors, Arnett points to Bitcoin's recent market volatility. If anything, she says it emphasizes the fact that Bitcoin can be difficult to incorporate into your diversified portfolio. 2. Commodities when inflation picks up investors often turn to tangible assets likely to rise in value. Prices for raw materials like oil, metals, and agricultural products usually increase along with inflation, so they can be a good hedge against it. Investors however should note that commodities can also be extremely risky Arnett adds. The prices for commodities depend largely on supply and demand, which can be highly unpredictable. This makes them a risky investment, on top of investors taking on leverage. The chance of rewards are high, but so are the risk of losses. 3. Gold Gold has traditionally been a safe haven asset for investors when inflation revs up or interest rates are very low. Gold tends to fare well when real interest rates, the reported rate of interest minus the inflation rate. Investors often view gold as a store of value during tough economic times, and it has succeeded in this purpose over long periods. One good option for investing in gold is to buy it through an ETF, so you won't have to actually own and protect the gold yourself. Plus, you have several options with ETFs, allowing you to own physical gold or the stocks of gold miners, which can offer a higher upside if gold prices soar. While gold doesn't always protect against rising inflation in the short term, it tends to keep up over the long term, meaning decades. 4. REITs Real estate is a popular choice because it becomes a more useful and popular store of value amid inflation while generating increased rental income. Single-family homes financed with low, fixed-rate mortgages tend to perform well during periods of inflation. As inflation climbs, your property is likely to appreciate in value, while the monthly service cost of your mortgage stays the same. This is at the very heart of building home equity, which can rapidly increase your net worth. Real estate traditionally does well during periods of higher inflation, as the value of property can increase. 
This means your landlord can charge you more for rent, which in turn increases their income so it is on pace with the rising inflation. Beyond homeownership, real estate investments can be made through REITs ETF, also known as real estate investment trusts, which invest in REITs. 5. Stocks. Stocks can be good as a long-term inflation hedge, but can suffer in the short term if inflation spikes. Stocks have a reasonable chance of keeping pace with inflation, but when it comes to doing so, not all equities are created equal. For example, high-dividend-paying stocks tend to get hammered like fixed-rate bonds in inflationary times. Investors should focus on companies that can pass their rising input costs to customers, such as those in the consumer staples sector. If you're new to the investing world, it's easier than ever to get started. To do so, you'll need to open an account through a brokerage or trading platform. Select reviewed more than a dozen online brokers that offer discounts to zero commission trading to find the best options for new investors. The top brokerages for free stock trading have the widest range of investment options, user-friendly technology, quality customer support and educational resources. Thanks for watching. If you like our video then hit the like button and don't forget to share and subscribe to our channel Trade VSA for more valuable videos.